Hello everybody and welcome back to episode 6 part 2 with uh, Stewie and me playing SnowRunner. For those of you that were with us on the last episode, you saw that we left off uh, having just fished out these parts that we need for the shop. There was a little bit of confusion going on, but we have, thanks to Deck Plays on, on YouTube there, thanks to the YouTube community, we have figured out that we need these service parts for the reason of restocking the warehouse like I thought it was to enable us to then be able to pick up those iron beams or whatever to complete the first part of this right here so that we don't have to go as you can see here uh, so we don't have to go all the way over to the steel mill to transport it over uh, it's an option of course to do that but we will be needing everything from here anyways because as we follow up on this road, um, coming past this, I think it's an abandoned factory actually, uh, we will be fixing this road as well, that's going to take us even further in. We've got a tower right here, and then that'll take us to the next part of um, what it is that we need to get to that truck. So, for right now... Uh, Stu and me, we, we were able to dig our way out of this. That was part of what you saw. I guess we ended it right here, actually. Um, and in the meantime, he took off and grabbed us a fuel trailer with a scout. We actually learned that it was pretty dang fast for him to just drive, follow the, the ice here the entire way, and grab some fuel and come, come back, zipping back to us. So, that vehicle that he has, the Yar, is really, really good for this area. Now, next part is for me, I guess, to get, uh, to get that where he's at. Because this mud up ahead here is mud and snow. Again, this map, it's, it's ruthless. It is pretty much just like the first Russian map mixed with a little bit of Alaska on top. Uh, the soil is so thin, you, you dive in so deep, and at the same time, you have the snow and freezing conditions. And sometimes the freeze out can be good, whereas, you know, you have the ice, but not always, as it, the snow tends to just make it more slippery. Do we sit in right here? Ready to give us some more fuel. That's exciting. So, <clears throat> this trailer, I guess, unlocking that upgrade, or not upgrade, but unlocking the, the shop there where we need to be going. I'm <laughs> just pushing him out of the way. That's great. Uh, unlocking the shop all the way that we needed to, to be to give us those iron beams. It's proven to be quite the amount of work, but we already knew that coming in, so it's just a matter of trucking tr through. All right, let's see if we can refuel off of his trailer. Oh, and also one more thing. So as you guys noticed in not the last episode, but the one before then, uh, where we were rescuing rescue parties, rescue mission. As a rescue job, <laughs> it still cracks me up. Over in Russia, um, we had an issue with overfueling, like stealing all the fuel off the vehicles. Apparently, if you just tap, you get a little bit as opposed to holding for full refuel. Because that's what I literally read. Hold for full refuel. So I thought that's what you needed to do. Like that. But, no. Anyhow. <laughs> that's funny. I was only tapping it. Yeah, well, I guess you were a little smarter than me. And welcome, Stewie. Uh, I guess you're finally back, so I can give you your introduction here now. Welcome to uh, episode six, part two. The second part of our great rescue endeavor, rescue mission, rescue job to get yet another greater, better truck. <laughs> it's just, what is it with us and our rescue crap, huh? You know what I mean? Oh. 
that's what you have to do in this game, I guess. Yup. I mean, it's pretty much all that it is about. Alright, so what are we doing now? Well, right now, I'm taking in the scenery, actually. Look at the snow just falling in. You have very little daylight gleaming through the fog and mist and all that this crap. This is an intimidating landscape, dude. Like, I would probably piss my pants if I didn't have you out here trying to do all this on my own. <laughs> well, we all know how that goes. Doesn't take much <laughs> until you owe me a diaper, remember? <laughs> oh, technically, that's an inside joke. Uh, the viewers didn't get to see that because that was recorded off camera last time. But... <laughs> if I don't give myself some tremendous scares, I can always count on Stewie giving me plenty of scares. Yeah, I was going to say, what happened again? Can you remind me? So it was when we were transporting that big ass train on top of the low boy with this right here. And we were getting so close. Uh, and then you were talking about, well, don't go too far now as you tip over. And I'm like, nah, I'll be fine. I let go of the winch and it was like another millimeter, like a hair's width or whatever uh, from falling over and tipping over. And it was all that work for freaking nothing. All because I was going to be a tough boy. Not wish on again. <laughs> Felt like it was kind of a. Uh, well, anyways, yeah, it was just fun. So it was like, ah, oh, you made me piss my pants just then. Uh, squealed like a little girl slash pig, and uh, eh, may or may not have trinkled. I'm not in pants, no, I'm just kidding. Of course not. Just thought it was funny to toss out the comment. You owe me a pair of not underwear, but diapers. It's just guaranteed that I'll freaking freak out. I mean, can you blame me though? We're putting in so much effort into these these missions. There's so much time going into getting this job done. Yeah. Oh, on track. Right. Not a proper road though. We made it. We made that road. Yep. Okay. For yeah. shits and giggles. Yeah, Oh, oh, no, okay. This is right. good, no, that's bad, don't do that. I was gonna say no. <laughs> yeah, no, I was about to say, for shits and giggles, let's see how far out into the ice I can just drive. And then the game, the world's like, Mother Nature's like, nope. I'm gonna jump <laughs> it right there. So, yep, I'm gonna... <clears throat> I'm gonna stick to the side, I reckon. And thank you for bringing the fuel, bro. Much appreciated. I fuel both of us up. Yep, nice. Oh, yeah, fueled me up too. Did you fill me up, did you? Yep. Thank you. Yeah, that's oh. the cool thing about these videos here. Yep. There's a lot of opportunity for tutorials. You good or do you fall over? No, I'm good. It's just uh, my back was bouncing around everywhere. Have you seen it bouncing around yet? Not yet, but I can, uh, I can believe it. Hey, I'll get it to do it if I can. Here, come on. You and your showmanship. I still need to be honest. I thought that would have made it. Up there. Oh, if I grab onto that, I'll work. Ah, uh, yep, come on. Oh, oh. oh, thank you, thank you. Thank you, bro. Where are we going, left? Left. Left and down onto the ice. <clears throat> Come on, get out of the snow. Hang on, hard right. Oh, started drifting. Yep, the ice here is relentless. Jeez, isn't it? 
Are you in low gear? Looks like you're spinning. Nah, no. Yeah, I, oh, well, I mean the higher, like, you know. Yeah, I don't have the luxury of a uh, gearbox to change this thing right here. Yeah. This boy. Nah, I do. And gosh, for that, it does help a lot. Yes. I know it's um, not looks bad, but I think you should follow me. No, I agree. I will. Once right now, it's just all about momentum. Probably get out this little bit here. <laughs> you just whipping that fuel trailer all over the place. Yeah, that's what I mean. Bouncing everywhere and that. Yeah, I think it could have done with a little wider axle just as wide as yours, uh, bigger suspension, and yep. uh, same balloon tires as yours. I reckon that would have been good. Mm -hmm. Oh, 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 sure. oh. Great. Don't make me crash into you. I need to keep my momentum. Yeah, I was more worried about that thing that I spotted, sorry. Uh, if I ended up in that, I was gonna stop. And there's another one just here, I think. Yep, but it's a little further out. No, it's right here. That's why I went around it. Go. Oh, yeah, they, all, all these are courtesy oh, oh, of me. Oh, no. Are you done or do you need you need help? You're good. Why am I moving? Because you're on ice. Do you need help? Um, I'm moving slowly. Okay. I just want to make sure before I jump over here. Yeah, yeah, just stay there for a sec. I'll let you know if I can. Get out of this. This is. <laughs> yeah, this is what I'm worried about. <clears throat> Alright, out of there now. Yay. Alright. Um, not sinking. Good. Wait, oh, wait. Are we going across there? Yep. I believe we are. Okay. Go for it, bro. <laughs> you can do it. Oh my gosh, this is so scary! <laughs> oh my gosh, that's a lot of weight for that ice to just. Oh. Yeah, and, you, and it crumbled a bit. Let's see if I can make it across still. Yep. Yeah, hopefully your your little fart nugget will be able to get over. Oh. That would be devastating. I just got 16 damage or whatever. Okay, as long as I can get past these rocks here, uh, you probably ought to attach yourself to me. No, I think I ought to go in front of you and help drag you up. That may, may be an idea, yeah. Yeah, well, right how can I get around you? Okay, tell you what. Yeah, I'm gonna go that, this just that, just that, just that, just that. Stay there, stay there. Could have got past. Oh. And I could have helped drag you up. Might wait for it. Not yet. No, no, what? How can I not? Did it grab onto you? No. Grabbed on something here. There we go. Oh, don't pull it too much, bro. Yeah, let's do this right now. Since since I'm still moving forward, I just don't want to risk pulling you down. No, no, you're all right. It's all good. I'm just helping you out a bit. Keeping your momentum going. Oh, crap. Until that rock fucked you up. I even tried to pull you a little bit towards uh, me, but it didn't work. Can you get that tree there? Use that tree to your right. All right, we're doing actually a lot better than what I reckon we would. I was really worried about that. Oh, hello. I was really, Sorry, really man. worried about this uh, section here. Oh, just fucking barely moved, unfortunately. If I get ahead, I'll, I'll winch. 
um, and get my speed back a little. Yeah, remember alternating between auto and, uh, and low gear. Yeah, I'm alternating all the low gears right now. I've got three of them. Three low gears is helping. Looks like you made it just in time. That was almost yeah. like... That was like perfect. Yep. It's like we had planned that out. It was just meant to be. <laughs> Not too much there. Go back to this one. All right. Before we continue here, though, I'm gonna stop for a second, go to the engine, and check what the heck this cargo called consumables. Oh, they have lost their. Got it. Yeah, we're not gonna worry about that. Sorry, guys. You and your cult can hire someone else. We are a little bit busy. <laughs> that mission right here that we just passed yep they want us to drive around the map and pick up cargo boxes of food essentially um yeah yeah I know I remember seeing four, four I remember hour session seeing, right there I remember seeing the the mission thing Like you just roll up over top of it. You're good. Yeah, I tried planning it as best I could. Woo. Oh shit, wait. Sorry. I forgot. Hard right. Uh, look, I'll let you go if I can. You Sorry. make your hard right. Oh, don't you dare. Don't you dare. Okay, that's as much as I can give you. Yep, yeah, that's right. I'll just move out of your way. You can do the hard right. I forgot about the hard right. Sorry. Close these boulders. Stop screwing with me. Oops. Be careful, right? What, I'm on vacation, man. What are you talking about? Be careful. Same, because the, um, the uh, ledge yeah, rocks. Joe. Uh. Well, I'm definitely cleaning up a pretty nice path for you now. With Moving all these rocks. Like this. Yes, thank you. Alright, here's the thing of speed, and hopefully we can sustain minimum amount of damage. I'm so worried! Oh no, I just fucking rolled it. Oh. I hope you'll be able to save yourself, man, because now I'm over. I cannot come back for you. Alright, oh, skills yeah, got, got Yeah, I see. Nice. I, can stew my I, was I was only lucky to get that rolled back that time. Don't roll again, please. Thank you. Alright, where's this jump? There. Not one. Try and line up a bit better if I can. Yeah. Oh, no. You're gonna need to pull me out of this fight. Uh, there's right. no me getting. There's no me getting over that. And damn, man, I took a lot of damage. It's all right. You got some repair parts on you, don't you? Yeah, I think I do. Pretty sure I do. Yeah, I got repair parts. It says repair, so sure I do. But I nearly ended up in the drink. And that's what's going to be the scary part about moving me. Well, we'll make sure that sailor don't end up in the drink. Well, as long as you latch on good enough, you can, I'm sure you can pull me out. As long as I, don't, I land on, on my right side, it's all good. Because the current will push me into the mountain. But if I land on the other side, then yeah. You gotta be fishing. <laughs> <laughs> Doing a little stewy, stewy fishing, huh? Yeah.
it nice and close so you can like yank me up a little. Do I need to try and move back or something? I don't know what the hell is wrong with my system now, it doesn't. You get the winch? Yeah, I selected the point, but it doesn't let me select another point. There we go. Uh, Got me. Auto winch, a stupid auto winch to the rest oh, of the uh. oh. We're fishing. We're fishing. Almost fishing. We're fishing. We're fishing. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my gosh, man. Okay. <clears throat> Safe and sound. Safe and sound. Bump, bumper bump. There you go. That's that's our version of fist bump, I guess. <laughs> yeah. Oh my gosh. That was Dude, I about you owe me a diaper. <laughs> see, <laughs> see everyone now. You, yeah, the diaper. Yeah. I guess it's better to just give it as per description instead of, or not description uh, as per the situation instead of description. Ah, uh, whatever. Just don't want them to feel left out, you know what I mean? <laughs> but I'm pretty sure also the majority rule say I don't care. Don't need to know about your pig guys. Which is I suppose And now it's doing the same thing again. I can't attach my winch. Just have to do this though. It attached? Yeah, but I have to use the auto thing. I can't use the manual where to place the winch. Anymore. No. Yeah, that thing is playing up. Well, not that one exactly, but it, the game like to play up in its own little ways. It's got yes. some bugs still. Got to fix out those kinks. Yes, just get very much so. Just, just get the ironing out. You'll fix those kinks. <laughs> right. <laughs> How you doing up there? Doing okay. I'm gonna avoid that mud pile that I ended up in last time. Do you need a winch onto me? Nah, it should be good. There's trees here. The only time I kind of need your help is if it's, uh, with, after getting this vehicle, is if I'm in a sticky situation where I, I'm going to end up in a drink or something. Yep. Other than that, I think I should be able to pull myself out of just about any situation unless there's no trees and stuff around to latch onto. Hey, would you mind uh, just telling the audience your reference of the drink? Oh, the water. Uh, not everyone really understood that. Uh, yeah, I thought they'd get it since I was right next to the water saying I uh, end up in the drink. Just, yeah. All right. Now that that's taken care of. Oh, he's waiting for a big jump. If you want to go grab the truck that you have parked down by the bridge we are about to repair, you're going to have to come up here and grab service parts. And you actually only need two, I think. Go. And before you move too far... I'm not moving far. Hang on, 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 hang on. I'm coming up behind you. Or are you using the other dude? I was trying to... Damn it. I screwed up. Which, which you... one are you using? Um, this board. Oh, uh, that one. Okay, sorry. I just wanted to so fuel you them another one. Hang on. Just hang on. There we are. Alright. Yeah, well, I thought you were using this one and I'm just saying I'm trying to 
planking mic right next to you. Order. Wooden planks, concrete, service parts, spare container, metal rolls, fuel, bricks. Wait, am I picking it up from the wrong spot? Is that... Oh, that's why. Okay. Well, don't judge my horrible backing skills. There we go. Yeah, I need to... Oh, bit. no. No. What'd you do? It crashed. Oh, my gosh. So now you're going to have to move all your vehicles. Uh. <sighs> That's really a pain in the butt. But this is on Xbox, you know? It's not like PC where you're like, you know. Oh, no. Metal beams, there we go. He has limited cargo though, so I guess that's one thing to pay attention to. Yeah, now we just have to go down the road and start repairing that and then come back up and grab some service parts. And then we'll be good. Are you starting to notice that I am though? What's up? So, last time I crashed was after you took fuel out of my, my tank, yeah? This time again. Well, how come you didn't crash earlier at the beginning? <laughs> when, when, oh, yeah, you did take I'm not sure. Can't answer that one. Um. All right. <coughs> oh wait, the code changed, didn't it? That's the dumbest thing ever. Show task, cargo management. Now, can I deliver those? Yes. Unload and unload. Perfect. Don't worry guys, we're not letting Stu miss out on some points here. We still have to get the service parts. Um before we get to complete this. <clears throat> um yeah, can I have the code so I can get back in? S134 E. It is that one still? Yep. What a change. Okay. <clears throat> Changed from the very first one. First one was a pain, though, wasn't it? Yes. Over this. Yeah, but right, stick to the side here so we have some traction on the snow. And looky here, Stewie is back. Welcome back, man. Thank you, bro. And the only problem is now I need to drive all the way back out there. Yep. But, at the very least, now you don't have to worry about driving over the ice. As soon as I get to complete this, we can use the bridge. Which means we can use the partially effed up. Um, <clears throat> So then which truck am I using? Am I changing trucks then? Hang on. You may want to use... Here, let me synchronize with you. So there's a tower. Where the heck are you? Okay. So if you go out the garage, right? And take a right. And follow the main road down the right. It'll kind of... It turns into dirt. And it disappears, but there's a tower right in there. Mm -hmm. If you head to that tower, yeah, uh, that'll allow us to reveal the next part, because I think the landslide on the highway is what I'm going to be doing. So I can I can keep fixing this on from my end now. If you want to just work on getting that unlocked right there, and then meet me, just keep driving on that road essentially after you've unlocked that tower until you hit the landslide, and we'll both meet up at the landslide section. Because then, 
you'll be able to bring your truck. Because we're going to need to transport three things. Okay, so right now, start engine. Are you following? Yep. I'm just trying to get my sheet down. Where on earth did you put it on there? Okay, luckily we have an equal amount of those. No trailer this time right now. Yeah, no, you can just use your yar and explore that area as is. I think you'll make it with the fuel you have. I mean, you have three times the capacity in that one compared to uh, the other DLC truck that I have. Except for I can't get up the damn hill. Oh my gosh. Oh, you can. Just uh, creep up a little bit on the side to the snow. Because the ice itself is a horrendous. Yep, I know that. Chucked it in low gear, I'm good now. Yep. Best thing about low gears. Back into auto. Probably low gear again. As I bump into my trailer. Alright, you ready for some serious experience points? Here we go. No, it's just yeah, nice. Now this bridge is done. And 890 points. And that should have brought me up to 11. Yep. And I need mm, 1,080 more to get to 12, which is exactly where I need to be. For the good tires oh. on Bandit. I need a bit more, but yeah. Yeah, we'll get there. We got plenty of missions to be doing here. Yeah, well, I don't think I get you know the air, you know the areas explored. You get the 50, 50, 50, whatever. I don't get that. That's how you get in front of me. Well, that's dumb. I know, right? I get it in my world though, just not in yours. Why isn't the select winch point and all this working? Well, it doesn't matter because this right here is the end of this part of the video. So, we will see you all in part three, I guess, of episode six. As always, toss us a like. It's much appreciated. It'll help the YouTube algorithm toss the video out to other people out there that might enjoy the content. And course give us your feedback we would love it anything negative anything bad anything good of course as well as much appreciated don't just be hating um, let us know what you want to see more of what you want to see less of and uh, if it would deserve a sub subscribe from you I would be lovely thank you all for watching and we'll see you in the next one anything you want to say to the audience too uh, like comment share and subscribe <laughs> <laughs> you're such a robot okay <laughs> see you all in the next one